What's going on guys? I'm about to board my flight to Lima. Just landed in Peru and Lima. Ready to get to the hotel, drop stuff off, go out to the club. Taxi right now on the way to the first hostel from the airport. So happy to be in Peru right now. Can't stop smiling. Going to a new country. It's always a new experience. New people, new places, new friendships, new relationships. New in the local marketplace you always want when you're traveling to go to the local marketplaces they have the best clothes the best deals you can bargain also you always want to try something step out of your element and try something crazy I'm about to try Inca Cola for the first time the Cebolla Peru this is the flavor of Peru so I had to try it I'll let you know how it is not the best thing I taste tasted but it's all right it tastes like a cream soda but worse, it's alright, man. It's morado. I had a drink yesterday at my hostel that they made called Chicha Marana. They made it out of this corn, purple corn. Hopefully do some crazy shit. We'll see. First time I saw the ocean going in a day, even from a distance. It's beautiful. I'm, I can't stop smiling. <laughs> We're out here at Museo de Pisco, which we thought was a museum, but it just happens to be a bar. It doesn't really matter because we were just gonna take shots in it anyways. It's an educational bar, babe. They have stuff on the wall. Educational, educational. We're learning some shit. He brings out this first. We thought that that was the Pisco shots. These are the Pisco shots. He brought out the glass of water because this is the strongest Pisco shot they have. So he thought that we might throw up. Fuck that shit. You don't need no water. I'm drinking anyways because I'm dehydrated from drinking so much past two days, but we don't need it though. Ready? It's how fucking tans do it. Right here. Salud. That's cute. I remember when I had my first beer. We're here in uh, the center of Lima right now, standing right in front of the house of the president, president's house, uh, Plaza Governmental, what is it called? Palacio, oh, Palacio. 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 whatever, <laughs> anyway, the, government, the president lives the government here. Um, so we're going to go in and meet the Mr. President, Palacio you know, probably have lunch with him, I think he's a cool guy, I'm joking, we're not doing that, we're in the center right now, so we're going to go check out some cool shit, let's do it. Out uh, here in the uh, city center in Lima, we just got these uh, chicken arepas. Oh my god, I cannot wait to take a bite. I'll let you know how it is. Mm, good. Baby, food fanatics right here, baby. Holy shit, man. Loving life. Here in Lima, and there's a fucking crazy fire. Apparently, five floors are on fire. People, guys, pray for these people. Yeah, Mira Flores in Lima. We're in the park in the center, Candy Park. This is where we went out to all the clubs the first couple days. The clubs are right down this street. 
Um, they have some tight spots. This is where our hostel is. We're staying in Puri, Puriwana Hostel. And the first day I stayed in Puriwasi, and it's right around the corner. Dope, dope party hostels. Gotta check them out if you're ever around this area. I think it's a good place to stay if you're in Lima. Hey guys, um, here in Lima, taking a shit. Welcome. So I want to talk to you guys about life. You know, there's there's ins and there's outs. But you know life is good, so you know, smile, drink a beer, sit down, let it fluctuate. Circuito Magico del Agua. I probably messed up that name, but basically it's a light show in Lima with uh, fountains and different lights. It's absolutely nuts. Let's go check it out. My first time too, come on. Yeah, you can go. 